I pulled out the facts on God. I convinced him that the good deeds I've done outweighs the bad that I've done. He had no choice but to let me in. Oh, I fake cried my way into heaven. I made God feel guilty. Yep, made him feel bad about trying to send me to hell. God said I was annoying him and asking him too many questions, so he told me to stand outside the gate. So if God said I'm indecisive, and he said, if I want to go to heaven or hell, you need to stand out here and decide. But he said something really funny. Well, I thought it was funny, but he didn't think it was funny. I just told God to send me where I got to go. He said, to hell you go. I told him I like hot showers in it. One of the angels was staring at me, so I told him to fly away. God said I was being rude, and I said, don't they have wings, though? He said, are you being sarcastic? I said, if the halo fit. I asked God what food they had here. He said, wine and crackers. I said, okay, what does hell have? He said, go find out. And I did. I yelled at God because he said I'm not a real child of God. I said, what the hell is that supposed to mean? He said, fire fits me perfectly. I told one of the angels to hold me back. He was taking too long talking about how great heaven was. I was like, does hell have a shorter wait time? I told him to hurry the hell up. I said, can you give me the Ten Commandment version? He said, I was trying to take his job. He said, I got a place for you. I was like, in that chair because you're not doing your job. And he was like, no, I got another place for you. God said I was judgmental. He said only he could judge. I said, order in the court because that's wrong. There was too much drama between heaven and hell in the gates. I said, yeah, I'm going to stay down here. Chilling it is.